Google Forms has a quiz feature. And to do that, you'll just go ahead and you'll go to Google Drive and then go to Google Forms. And you can create a quiz. And to do that, you just need to go to Settings, oops, sorry, Settings, and go to Quizzes, and then just make this a quiz. I'm going to cancel that because I've already created a quiz. And so this is the quiz that I created. And um, so I've got my questions. You can also add a response um, feedback so that if the, the, if the kids get the question wrong, when, when they, hit, they get their feedback, they'll get this little link that shows them what their answer is correct, which answer is correct. And then I also um, created uh, this right here. If you click here and you go to go to section based on answer. So if they got the question wrong, then I have them go to a video to watch and then they can go back and, and change their answer. And then they can submit their form here on the one that's correct. And so I created that second section that they go to. So this is how it works. So let's go to the quiz. And I'm going to go ahead and just choose some answers. And if I put incorrect answer here, we'll put the incorrect answer here. And we'll then we just go to next. And then it takes me to this Order of the Planet song. So I can go and review that. And I can hit the back button and I can say, oh, this is the wrong answer. I can click that. Go to next. And then I could submit. Now I have this set up right now so that um, the kids don't get their responses until I submit them. You can also click on the settings. Maybe. And you can say that immediately when they get their, when they submit, then they'll get the answers um, of what they scored on the quiz. This one here, if you put that one there, let me just show you what that does. I can go to the responses. If I go on summary, then I can come here and I can release the scores. So the nice thing about that is if I go to individual here, I could go ahead and so they'll get this feedback when they get their scores, but I can also add some individual feedback and I can say, Kathy, you need to check this article. And I can put specific feedback on these items for students. So when I submit the scores, let's see, it was in here. I'm, I know I need to be on the summary. And then I can go ahead and release the scores. And then because I've already done this, it's going to send me an email and release my scores. And your kids, if they have access to email, will be able to get those. Now, kids have access to email. It's just that kids in eighth grade and above have access to outside email. So your students in the elementary may not have access to email. So their students may not have access to that, but I can always turn that on for you. So there's my score, comes in my email, and I can see what my score was. So it's really kind of a nice feature to um, have your Google create your own quizzes for you.